This year, Magnum Opus celebrates the summer solstice on June 21st with a tailored ritual which exemplifies ritualistic devil worship and demonic conjuring. Our coven continues this tradition of offering satanas, our fertile group, to acquire and focus large amounts of energy which, applied by the coven and delivered by our demonic familiars, brings our medium to laser focus. The time between the summer solstice ritual, which plants the seed, and the harvest of the grand climax is sacred. This is a time of satanic incubation to ready the coven for the reward of diligence and patience. The celebration and associated coven solidification allows huge amounts of energy to be created, focused, and applied at the right time and in the right amount, synchronized and orchestrated by Satanas himself. Most Satanic practitioners are on a lifelong journey in pursuit of perfection in their practice of Satanic magic. The practitioner is constantly evolving and transforming into more efficient and effective magician. For those who are truly dedicated to the dark arts, status quo is not enough. Anything remaining the same is not acceptable, and the movement and momentum for perfecting one's craft becomes paramount in the day-to-day -day working that will lead the practitioner to perfection of his or her enlightened processes. To accept substandard results is not satanic. There are certain stages of skill that one will go through on their journey from novice to acolyte to proficient. It is a never-ending cycle of corrections, improvements, assessments, and adaptation day by day to incorporate and improve things once learned. A person can approach the study of magic as a situation that never ends. It is a path which we continue to travel since the practitioner will never feel totally satisfied with his or her abilities. There will always be a desire and a drive to do more, to improve upon that which is mastered with confidence, competence, and skill, always improving his or her effectiveness. As Satanists, we are always longing for the next thing we will discover. It is this natural inquisitiveness which separates us from other paths and we recognize the potential for self-discovery with satanas. If a person diligently practices magic, he or she may become quite proficient. However, if a person believes he or she will become proficient by reading a book and never experimenting to find the magical pathway, he or she will ultimately lose interest and drift to the next trend, or fad. These lost and wandering searchers are doomed to repeat this cycle until accepting the fact that magic requires investment, and without investment, they will always be on the outside looking in. Being dedicated also means being passionate about the practice. To love the art and learn the art is to spend time with the art. Magic is a sweetheart, a lover who is jealous and always needing more and more of your time. Invest in the relationship with self, spirit, and your entire being. You may study and practice a lifetime and still never feel that you are even at the point of a novice. Satanic magic is a never-ending journey that will bring great benefits 
but those benefits come with a price. You must balance your investment with your intended return on investment, giving 100% at all times. It is not an easy path, but it's one that pays great dividends to the dedicated. I challenge each and every one of you to strive to increase your abilities and competencies while never accepting status quo. Always know great things come to those that not only wait, but take actions while they wait. Ave Satanas.